What's up everyone, this is Cyber8610 and today we have some more Yu-Gi-Oh cards to talk about with you guys that have been revealed and for this one we have some of Kaiba's cards that are uh, getting brought back and with this of course that means XYZ Dragon Cannon is actually getting some new support or even kind of a reimagining and that is uh, ABC Dragon Buster. So with this, of course, that means Union Monsters are finally back. Just like how Spirits finally got some new support, Toons finally came back, and even Ritual Monsters were finally seeing some new Union Monsters. And with these two, I feel like there's some new hope for Unions, and it kind of shows how, uh, how we might see future Union Monsters in general, because with the game changing as much as it has, I mean, the Union Monsters came out in the original series, so the game has changed a lot since then. I mean, we've had uh, synchros, Xyz, pendulums, and, and everything too, and uh, the game's gotten so much faster that uh, I think with how these cards are working and everything, uh, they could actually make unions relevant again, which is really cool. And the difference too on this is all three are actually union monsters, they're not any normal monsters this time. And uh, also, uh, their effects are really similar too, so I'm just gonna read off the first one's effect, and after that, I'll tell you how it's slightly different because they're basically the same text with just some slight differences. So here we go. First one we have is a Assault Core. It's a Light Machine Union Monster, level 4, 1,900 attack, 200 defense. Its effect is uh, once per turn you can either target one Light Machine type monster you control, equip this card to that target, or unequip this card and special summon it. While equipped by this effect, the equipped monster is unaffected by your opponent's card effects. If the equipped monster would be destroyed by battle or card effect, destroy this card instead. If this card is sent from the field to the graveyard, you can add one other Union Monster from your graveyard to your hand. So basically, this is the card that is able to protect you from monster effects. And then obviously with that, you can tell what I mean by slight variations. You have another one that we're going to talk about here in a second that is able to protect you from spells, and then the last one that's able to protect you from trap cards. So yeah, they're just able to protect you from different things. What I like on this one too is that it's 1,900 attack. That means it's actually stronger than X-Head Cannon. That's kind of surprising. I mean, X-Head Cannon's always been known for being the, the strongest one out of all of them, so that's cool to see. And uh, another thing too is each one has another variation on how it's able to uh, recycle or get you a Union Monster. With this one, you're able to, whenever it's, you know, sent from the field to the graveyard, you're able to add a Union Monster from your graveyard to your hand. Uh, essentially allowing you to be able to recycle some Union Monsters and getting them back and uh, be able to go for whatever you want to. Which is nice too, it makes it so you can use these with the older Union Monsters, the XYZ Dragon Cannon, or, or VW I should say as well, or you can use them with each other, and, and just that. So uh, I think it's really great support and showing that, you know, another way of being able to get what you need on, on the field, and that's kind of what Unions needed because they're so much slower, or they were so much slower, because of how the game has changed, and I think with all these recycling abilities and being able to search and different things too that you're going to be seeing from them, uh, that's definitely going to speed them up and help them out to be competitive against uh, other archetypes out there. So, really cool to see this, and uh, let's talk about the next one. And the next one is B Buster Drake. Again, uh, basically the same stats on that. It's Light Machine Union, uh, level 4, uh, 1,500 attack, 1,800 defense. It's a little more defensive. Uh, the effect is essentially the same. The only difference is this one protects from spell cards. And also, uh, the last part of its effect is if this card is sent from the field to the graveyard, you can add one Union Monster from your deck to your hand. So this one's a little bit more of a searcher, and uh, that's pretty much it. I mean, it gives you more of a searching effect to get a, a Union Monster from your deck to your hand, which is really nice. Probably has the best uh, last part of its effect than the others, and uh, being able to protect from spell cards is pretty cool too. I mean, there's not much else to say honestly on that, just being able to search is good, and that extra protection against spell cards is always a plus, I guess, too, on that too. And then after that, we have uh, C Crush Wyvern. This one, uh, let's see, again, Light Machine Union, level 4, 1,200 attack, 2,000 defense, even more defensive than the previous one. And uh, again, the effect is basically the same. This one being able to protect you from trap cards. And then the last part of its effect is, if this card is sent from the field to the graveyard, you can special summon one Union Monster from your hand. So this one's giving you uh, more of a special summon you know, instead of a searching ability, which is really nice. Again, being able to speed up your Union Monsters and get them on the field or in the graveyard or whatever, uh, 
as easily as possible because with ABC Dragon Buster, it, they can be on the field or in the graveyard, which we're going to get to that here in a second. But uh, yeah, that just basically speeds everything up, kind of like what the Magna Warriors did, essentially. And uh, yeah, I mean, there's not much else to say. Again, you're getting uh, protection against traps, just like the others would protect you against other things. And then that special summon Union Monster thing is going to be very helpful as well. Also, all of them being level 4 monsters gives you access to XC monsters, which is kind of funny, honestly, when you're already using XYZ, and then you can use XC monsters with it. So, so much alphabet in this episode. And of course, we're finally to the new fusion, and that is ABC Dragon Buster. It is a light machine fusion monster, level 8, 3000 attack, 2800 defense. It requires A, Assault Core, B, Buster Drake, and C, Crush Wyvern to fuse into it. And its effect is, must first be special summon from your extra deck by banishing the above cards you control or in your graveyard. You do not use polymerization. Once per turn, during either player's turn, you can discard one card, then target one card on the field, banish it. During your opponent's turn, you contribute this card, then target three of your banished light machine type union monsters with different names, special summon them. This is a quick effect. So basically, like with the Magna Warriors, you're seeing the same thing. You're seeing a combination card that can easily be brought out, whether they are in the graveyard or on your side of the field, you're able to uh, banish them and summon this card, which uh, is a really nice upgrade for XYZ Dragon Cannon. Uh, because that was something that was always tough about him. So with this, you're able to just banish them whether they be on your field or graveyard. You don't use polymerization, obviously. It's a contact fusion on that as well. And uh, yeah, I mean, it's just really easy to bring this guy out. Not only that, uh, you're able to discard a card, then target a card on the field and banish it. So that's even an upgraded version of uh, Dragon Cannon on that. And being able to discard a card isn't a bad thing anyway, because you probably want to add more of your Union Monsters to the graveyard to uh, go for another one of these or whatever you want to do on that. So that can easily help you out. And then, of course, it's the last effect where you're able to tribute it and then target three of your banished light machine Union Monsters with different names and special summon them. So able to defuse, basically, which can help you dodge certain effects and also go for even other cards. I mean, you don't have to go for, you know, Assault Core, Buster Drake, and Crush Wyvern. You can go for the, some of the originals or something too, which is uh, something that can be very useful for you because it just has to be light machine type union monsters. So there's a lot of different things you can do with that. Uh, so basically similar again to the Mana Warriors. I mean, I know I keep comparing the two, but they are, you know, such the, they are so much the same idea that uh, they have to be compared, that they are an upgrade of their older versions in every way. And you can even use the older versions with them. So I think that's really cool and a much needed upgrade for Union Monsters as well. And I'm hoping that means we're going to see more Unions in the future too. But yeah, let me know what you guys think in the comments, whether you like these new cards or not. Also tell me if you plan on using them and uh, which one are you more excited about? Are you more excited about the new Magna Warriors with Yuki's structure deck or more excited about the new uh, ABC Dragon Buster with uh, Kaiba's structure deck? Let me know in the comments. As always, thank you guys for watching. Be sure to like this video if you enjoyed it and subscribe for more Yu-Gi-Oh! videos. We still have plenty of uh, other cards to talk about, like how the Cyber Angels are finally getting printed as actual cards and even a new Galaxy Eyes XC monster. So, so much news today, and I hope you guys are looking forward to all of it. As always, thank you guys for watching, and of course I will catch you guys later. See ya! Hope you guys have enjoyed my latest video. Be sure to subscribe for more Yu-Gi-Oh! videos, as well as check out my other two channels, Cyber Night Games for Let's Plays, and also a Cyber Night CCG for Card Fight Vanguard openings. Thank you for watching, and I'll catch you guys later. See ya!